topic shopping. We're running a summer campaign. Everything is 50% off the regular price. Really? Everything? Yes, everything, including sunglasses, hats, and purses, is a discount. All of the summer clothing is also on sale. I really need to get some new sunglasses, because I'm going to take a trip to the beach next vacation. What do you think of this one here? Oh, they're lovely. How much do they cost? I can't see the price tag on them. It's fifty dollars. Hmm. So expensive. <gasps> oh, the glasses on that table look so pretty. How much? Oh, those are my sunglasses. I forgot to put them in my pocket. Really, I'd want to buy a pair of sunglasses similar to these. What store did you acquire these from? Actually, I paid $15 for them at Super Glasses. Isn't there a Super Glasses in this mall? Yes, but please allow me to show you the sunglasses we have for sale. Alright, but I think I'll just go to Super Glasses. Topic, a part-time job. I'm looking for part-time employment. Do you have any suggestions on where I should seek work? Have you checked the newspaper? I know there are several jobs postings in the newspaper, but there were no occupations that piqued my attention. Hmm. There are many websites with job ads that you might pursue. You know, I don't have a computer. It's hard to find information on the internet. I see. What kind of job would you like? I want to work in a restaurant. Fine. Will you need part-time or full-time work? I want to work part-time. There's a restaurant near school that's hiring waiters. Really? It's so good. That's right. You should apply now. Thank you very much. I will submit my CV right away. Topic Teamwork Jones, do you want to join our team? No, I'd rather work alone. Why do you say that? You know when you work as a team, you can accomplish a lot. I know, but I'm afraid I won't be able to fit in with everyone. Don't worry, everyone in the group is very friendly and kind. When working in groups, are all the tasks equally divided? Of course, when you divide the task, you may simply complete it. That's great. I'll join the group with you. Yeah, it's a wise decision. You know, everything should be done in groups, even household chores. Household chores? Yes, my family, for example. Although everyone is busy, when it comes to home tasks, we all work together to do them. Each of us has distinct responsibilities, so everything is completed quickly. I see. People should practice working as a team. Teamwork works. Topic, sports and health. Have you seen the Boston Marathon? Yeah, I went to see it in Boston. Whoa, you were in Boston for the marathon? Right? I went to see my friend run because she's a runner. We went to Boston together. You're really fortunate. What section of the marathon did you witness? I followed the race from start to finish. I don't know how the runners can finish the whole race. 
Yeah, it's really long and challenging. That's something I could never accomplish. I once attempted to run a marathon. It was really challenging. Me too. I only ran for 30 minutes and I was already tired. My health is not good anymore. Yes, running a marathon is a difficult task. By the way, did your friend finish the marathon well? She performed an excellent job. She wasn't the quickest runner, but she was a good one. Great. I hope one day I can go to Boston to watch the full marathon. Topic. Racquetball. Do you know how to play racquetball? I've never heard of this sport. What is racquetball? Racquetball is a well-liked sport. It was initially public in the United States. Do you know what year this game was invented and by whom? It was invented in 1950 by Joseph G. Sobek. Oh, it's a relatively new sport. Yeah, this sport is similar to tennis and squash. What about the rules of the game? Racquetball regulations are a hybrid of handball and squash rules. This game is played using a short racket. Oh, really? I find it a bit strange that you don't know about it. You know, when it initially came out, this game quickly became popular. You know, I'm not interested in sports. This game is suitable for people of all ages. However, the majority of today's players are young. They're mostly between the ages of 12 and 34. Topic, summer sports. Hello, Alice. So, what have you been up to? You appear weary. Last night, I stayed up to watch the Olympics. Oh, I know the men's basketball team earned a gold medal for us. In addition, we earned a silver medal in women's tennis. That's fantastic! So, how about gymnastics? The men's squad did not do well. The women's team, on the other hand, took silver. I haven't had a lot of time to watch. What are your plans for the summer? I've been playing baseball and learning how to swim. I enjoy watching baseball. Maybe I'll come to watch your squad play sometime. When do you play baseball? This weekend we have a match. Why don't you come to the park and watch us play? Sure, I gotta go. See you later. See ya. Topic, inline skating. Oh, my legs are in excruciating pain. Really, what did you get up to over the weekend? I went inline skating in the park with several pals. Did you have a good time? I did indeed, however, it was my first time, so it was really challenging. Did you stumble? Yeah, I'd fall, and now my muscles have become quite fatigued. The next time will be simpler. All you need is more practice. So, how about you? What did you get up to over the weekend? Actually, I went inline skating as well. Every weekend, I go with my father. Since when do you play inline skating? I started this sport three years ago. Each time, we skate around 20 kilometers. That's great. This sport also helps me to exercise. Wow, your muscles must be really powerful. Let's go skating together next weekend. Topic, the Olympics.
Do you know information about the Olympic Games? Of course. The Olympic Games are a well-known international sporting event. These games are only held every four years. There are both the summer and winter games. Do you know where the Olympics will be held in 2020? I know, in Japan. Where did the Olympics come from? The Olympic Games originated in Greece a long time ago. Men were the only ones who took part in them back then. Only a few sporting events took place. In the past, women were not allowed to compete in the Olympic Games? Yeah, but now women take part in the Olympic Games too. When were the first known Olympic Games held? The first modern Olympics were held in Athens, Greece in 1896. What color represents each continent in the Olympic rings? Each ring in the 16 prints symbolizes one of the five continents competing at the Olympics. Africa, yellow, the Americas, red, Asia, green, Europe, black, and Oceania, blue. Topic, travel and transport. I intend to do a cycling journey throughout Europe. Why do you want to go on a bike trip? As you know, spending your vacation on a cycling tour helps you feel recharged and refreshed. What do you need to do to go on a cycling trip? I'll need to ride my bike a lot before the vacation. That will help me become fit and powerful. I also need to purchase certain equipment. What type of tools will you require? I'll need roadmaps for the nations I'll be visiting. I'll also need sportswear and food. I think you also need to buy a big travel bag. Of course. Are you traveling with someone else? Yes, with my buddy. He enjoys going on bicycle rides. I wish I could go on a bike ride as well. If you want, join us for a bike ride this afternoon. Topic, driving down south. Isn't it wonderful that there are no lessons on Monday? We have three days off. Yeah, do you have anything special planned? My family and I are going to Las Cruces. It's something I'm really looking forward to. Have you ever visited there? No, although I've heard good things about it. Is it beautiful? Yes, there are several sights to view. The city is well known for its nuts. What type of nuts? Pecans. Many pecan trees may be seen in and around the city. I enjoy pecans. What is the distance between here and Las Cruces? If you utilize the freeway and go directly south, it only takes approximately four hours. That makes for a very simple journey. When are you going to leave? We'll leave on Saturday a.m. We'll be back on Monday evening. Have a good time. Please bring me some pecans. Topic, the travel agent. Yes, I'm Henry. I'm going to travel to Thailand next month, and I'd like to know the price of a trip. How long do you plan on staying? Approximately four to five days. We have a fantastic four-day, three-night tour package available. Okay, let me know the details. The options are flying with Qatar Airways from Montreal, or flying from Toronto with Thailand Airlines. What's the difference? Basically the price. Qatar is a little more expensive, but you have more flying space. Okay, can you tell us about the flight schedules? Well, if you want the Qatar flight, you have three flights a week, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, all at 1700 
Your tour guide will pick you up at the airport and transport you to your hotel. What about the hotel? If you want a good one, you have Marcus Hotel. Okay. Over the four days, you'll do a lot of sightseeing. Many renowned monuments, such as the Grand Palace, Chao Praya River, Demnoen Saduk Floating Market, and Kofifi. That's fantastic. What kind of transportation shall we take to get from one location to another? Your group will travel by car. Okay. Is it possible for me to book this package tour right now? We have five people. Topic: Taking the train. Marion, you're really fortunate. You're departing in five hours for Hawaii. I seldom travel since I hate traveling in an aircraft. I also dislike buses. There are many other means. You should go somewhere by train. I know. I haven't been on a trip in a long time. I've always wanted to go on a long train journey. What's holding you back? Go to a travel agency right now and inquire about rail journeys. What do you anticipate the prices will be? I'm not sure what the current rail prices are. I believe it's determined by your final destination. I'll have to ask the travel agent about that. You should. Can you recommend someone to chat to? My wife's travel agent was always happy to assist you. This is her phone number. Thanks. I'll call her right away. Topic: Go on a cruise. I want to go on a cruise ship. That sounds like fun. Where do you want to go? I want to cruise to Hawaii. That should be a nice trip. Lots of fun and lots of food. I have no idea how much it will cost. I think it depends on the season and on your cabin. Well, of course I want to go when the weather is nice. Yes, you don't want to travel in winter storms. And I want to get a big cabin with a view. Are you going to travel alone? No, my sister and I will travel together. Well, you should go online and try to find a good deal. Topic: Leisure and Entertainment. Oh my goodness! It's raining heavily. Today I wanted to go to the beach. This afternoon I'm going to a haunted house. If you like, you can go with me. A haunted house? What is that? It's really gloomy inside, with a lot of antique furniture and photos on the wall. It's full of spirits. It's dubbed a haunted home. <gasps> You've got to be kidding, right? I'm not a believer in ghosts. What is the location of this haunted house? The home is located in ancient woodland. Oh, are you certain you want to go? Why not? I thought you didn't believe in ghosts. Well, I'm not a big believer in ghosts, but. So what are you afraid of? You know, I'm not afraid of ghosts, but I'm afraid of the dark. <laughs> All right, I was simply kidding. The ancient home is not haunted. It is simply an old, vacant dwelling. Oof! Really? I'll come with you. Topic: A big screen TV. I'm thinking of purchasing a large screen television. 
Wow, I saw those at the store. They're quite expensive. Can you afford to purchase one? They are rather expensive. However, I like watching television. I believe that watching TV shows on a large screen is far more enjoyable. I've never watched television on a large screen. Do you believe the image is of high quality? Yes, the quality is excellent. When you watch soccer games, you feel as if you're on the pitch. Great. Can I come over to your place when you buy the TV? Of course, you can come at any time. Then I can watch TV with you on the large screen. No, I'm saving money to get a television. How much have you saved? Not too much. I think I might buy it in the next few months. Topic: He's famous. Are you going to see Tim Cross's new film tonight? I'm not sure. It appears to be quite dull. Really, it appears to be quite fascinating to me. Tim Cross is also a well-known actor. He may be well known, but I don't believe he's a really talented actor. He constantly appears in the same type of film. He never does anything out of the ordinary. At the very least, you think he's attractive, don't you? No, not at all. His eyes always look sleepy. There's only one expression. However, most females believe he's attractive. Perhaps this is why he is so well known. None of my pals think he's attractive. I used to enjoy him years ago, but now I think he's unattractive. Hey, I recently got a haircut. In an attempt to look more like him, except for good looks, his acting sucks. Topic: A housewarming party. Hello, how are you? Hey, Sarah, I'm well, thank you. How about you? I couldn't be better. I'm planning a housewarming party and would love for you to come if you can make it. That would be great. Where have you shifted your residence? Very close to you. We're now at the South Platte River, next to Bluedale School. Yes, you got it right. Please come with your husband. Okay. When is the function? On the twenty-fifth of this month. It is a Sunday. What time? Come around six p.m. That sounds like fun. Do you want me to bring anything? I'll be making plenty of food for everyone. If you'd like to bring something, then perhaps you can bring some wine or something to drink. I can't wait. How many people are you inviting? Probably around ten, including yourself. Okay, great. I'll see you on Saturday. Lovely. See you then. Topic: Making music. What kind of music do you enjoy listening to? I enjoy listening to all kinds of music. What kind? I like to listen to rock and R and B. What interests you in that type of music? I enjoy the different types of instruments that they use. That's a perfect reason to like a certain kind of music. Yeah, I'm currently taking a music composition class. So great! What did you learn in that class? I learned about musical instruments. The piano, violin, and drum are only a few examples. You want to be a composer? Yeah, like you know, composers are those who create music. Composer does not usually sing or perform his own music. That's great.
I think you're a really talented person. Let me listen to your song when you're done composing. Of course. Topic, science and technology. Hello, Steve. Take a look at my new MP3 player. Wow, it appears to be cool. What store did you buy it from? I bought it from an electronics website online. I'm not very adept with technology. Is it difficult to buy items online? It's really simple. All you have to do is go to the website and choose the thing you want. On the internet, there are so many products to select from. Is it that simple? Yeah, after you've decided what you want to buy, click the checkout button. It's quite a simple task. Yeah, super easy. Takes around a week for your goods to arrive. Huh, is one week too long? Doesn't it have a faster form of shipping? Of course, if you're in a rush, you may pay extra to have it delivered sooner. Do you pay for the items as soon as it arrives? No, you must pay for it online with a credit card. I got it. Topic, cell phone messages. I need to check my messages. How are you going to do this? We're right in the center of the highway. I'm going to make use of my cell phone. Have you ever done something like that? No, I just use my cell phone to communicate with others. Short text messages may now be sent and received using a cell phone. It's really beneficial. How to text on the phone? I just typed a short message on the phone keypad. Then I hit the send button. It's less expensive than calling. Sounds good. That way you can save both time and money. Right? Now, all my friends usually send me text messages. Thanks for letting me know this. I'll try it now. I believe you'll find it beneficial. Topic, bubbles in boiling water. I'm so hungry. I could eat a horse. Hey, that's not funny. Sorry, just kidding. Maybe we should cook something. What are we going to whip up? We don't know how to cook. We can't even boil water. I know how to boil water. All you need is a full pot of water and some heat. Is it that simple? With enough heat and time, that placid pot of water will turn into a bubbling, boiling cauldron full of hot, steamy water. When you boil water, where do the bubbles originate from? When water is boiled, it undergoes a physical change. The molecules of water don't break apart into hydrogen and oxygen, and then change physically from liquid to a gas. The gaseous form is water vapor. All of this is physics, isn't it? Yeah, to convert a liquid to a gas via boiling, the liquid must be heated. For water, 212 degrees Fahrenheit, 100 degrees Celsius, is considered the boiling point of water. Then the bubbles will disappear? When the water is boiled, the heat energy is transferred to the molecules of water, which begin to move more quickly. Then they form gaseous molecules of water vapor which float to the surface as bubbles and travel into the air. Topic, the blue sky. Joe just asked me a question regarding science, but I don't have a response. Science is one of my strong suits. Just ask me. Okay, what makes the sky blue? I'll explain it in a simple way. The sun's light travels in waves across the air. 
Isn't the light multicolored? Right? Gases and particles in Earth's atmosphere scatter sunlight in all directions. Blue light is scattered more than other colors because it travels a shorter, smaller waves. This is why we see a blue sky most of the time. Right. What about the other colors? They reflect off the objects they collide with. I don't understand. For example, your clothing is red because our eyes reflect red light. Now I understand why the sky is blue. Topic, a new camera. I recently purchased a digital camera. What's the matter with your old camera? Nothing. This one was purchased since I want to keep my photos on my PC. I get what you mean. I can also remove images that aren't really nice. I'm not required to print them. I prefer to get all my photographs printed. That's why I prefer vintage cameras. You may also print digital pictures. A lot of stores will print these for you. Really? Yes, you can even do it at home if you get a decent printer. That appears to be simple. How do you keep these digital photos? You may save these images to your PC. Great. And I keep all the photos I liked on compact CDs. On a single CD, you may save over 700 pictures. Great, maybe I should get a digital camera too. Topic, art and culture. Why do you have this misshapen vase, Jenna? That's the first vase I made in my glass blowing class. Glass blowing? What's that? Glass blowing is an art of forming hot glass into shapes by blowing air into the glass through a special tube. Why did you attend that class? Yeah, I'm taking it because I'm interested in culture and traditional crafts. Oh, cool. And glass blowing is a traditional craft? It is in many countries, including the U.S. It was one of the first crafts brought here. I think you're helping to preserve the cultural heritage of the country. That's really cool. This vase seems much more beautiful now. I think it's fantastic. I've never learned a traditional craft. You should try it. You could always come to my glass blowing class. That sounds great. I'll come next Monday. Topic, the Summer Music Festival. Have you heard about the Summer Music Festival? According to what I've read, it will include approximately 20 different bands. Whoa, a big festival. Do you intend to attend? If I can obtain tickets, I'll go. I heard that people would be queuing all night to acquire tickets. But don't worry, guess what I just got? What? Two tickets to the concert! <gasps> How did you get those? The concert has been sold out for months. My dad works at the arena. He was able to get front row seats. Are you serious? Yeah, I believe it'll be a fantastic music event that I will not want to miss. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, comment on my video. Please subscribe to Learn English with Jessica channel to watch more helpful videos. Goodbye.